Hello everyone, my name is Dakota. Welcome back to another video and today guys I'm going to show you guys something somewhat simple to set up for your live streams. More specifically using stream elements and I do stream on Twitch so as you can see up here in the top right corner this is my profile picture for my Twitch page. I showed you guys how to connect and set up kind of get kind of sort of get set up uh, to connect to stream elements and all that good stuff. So if you want to see that video links in the description check it out. Also up in the eye, there will be some videos as well. But today I'm just going to show you guys how to set up your chat alerts. Again, once you have your account connected, you're going to click on my dashboard. And this will take you to the main page you will go to to get everything started on stream elements. So over here on the left side, you're going to navigate to the bottom where it says bot. Click that little drop down menu. Go to modules. First thing you'll see chat alerts so you're going to click on this make sure it's turned on of course and then click on it drop down menu appears and then this is what you see this little box here obviously you guys can tell it's kind of like an example if anything happens in your stream basically it'll happen in your chat so if you're streaming from like a ps4 or xbox something like that and you don't actually have alerts and stuff set up this is a great option uh, so if someone follows, you'll be able to see that they followed, tip, host, subscribe, cheer, all that good stuff that happens on Twitch. So as you can see over here, they have the tips one turned on. And then down here it has uh, a host, two viewer hosts. So, But the cool thing is about this, you guys, you can customize what you do and don't want turned on. So for example, we have followers. This one is turned on. And then you have the custom message down here that you can use for whatever it is that you have turned on. So, for example, if you are using the followers, every time someone follows, make sure this little user name piece is in here. That way when they follow, it will say their name back to them. Uh, it'll highlight the message to that person. Not to you, just to the person that it's talking to, basically. And it'll say, thank you for the follow. So then you're going to know that that person followed your channel. So that's pretty awesome. So again, if you're using a con if you're streaming from a console and you need some alerts or some way to get alerts, this is one good way to do it. I know there's a few other ways out there to do that, but I uh, I don't stream from a console, so I don't really know how to do those, but I'm sure there's plenty of videos here on YouTube that'll show you. And then obviously you guys can see over here we have tips. Personally, I have tips turned off, so anytime someone donates via PayPal or something like that uh, through stream elements, uh, I have it turned off. It still pops up on my actual stream, but in the chat, it's turned off. Everything else I do have turned on, though. Hosts, subscribers, cheers, raids. Redemptions are turned off because I don't use the point system from stream elements. I don't have uh, a way to redeem anything. You do still earn points, but I don't have anything for you to redeem them for. As of right now so mine's turned off and then of course if you have merch set up through stream elements people buy it it'll pop up as well so these are all the different options you have this is for twitch i don't know if you log into youtube or log in through youtube or whatever or facebook or mixer or whatever it is you connect with if it shows different things so subscribing on twitch is different than subscribing on youtube so it might change i'm not 100 percent on all that but I would just keep that in mind if you are using stream elements in a different platform besides Twitch. These may be different options, which is obviously what it should be, but I'm not 100% on that. So as you guys can see, for each one that you click on, it gives you the available like lines you can use. So if you want it to say, to say for tips, their name and the amount, as well as a message if they send a message with it, you can see down here. I didn't mess with this one, but this is what it would look like. Next, we do have hosts, as you guys can see. Again, make sure whenever you're setting these up, you are if you want their name and the, the amount to appear in the chat, you have these correct user and amount, or whatever the case might be, message, just depending on which one you're selected under. So for this one, obviously, it'll say user hosted for blank viewers. So whatever the viewer number is, it'll actually put the number in there. So if it's not typed out like this, it'll look really funny in your chat. 
subscriber again the same way so there's that you could also um well first off as you guys can see there's one and in the two months one is for anyone that's a new subscriber doesn't matter if they paid for it or if it's twitch prime or whatever and then anything more than two months is considered a resub so there's that you can even go in here and add a message so if someone's been subscribed for 12 months you know so a whole year they get a special message you can go in there and customize that that's pretty awesome so i might actually end up doing that myself one of these days once i sit down and figure out what i want everything to say but that's just a thought cheers this is twitch's currency for those of you that don't know but again you can see it has the username just cheered and the amount which they call them bits so that's how that one works very very simple you could also do custom ones for this one as well so if someone were to send in you know a hundred bits or even a thousand bits you know or even five thousand bits you can customize the messages for the for them to show up in the chat really awesome raid raid is very similar to host so just make sure again you have those available lines in there and so it knows what to put redemptions um this one's a little different just because it says item but again i don't have any type of items to redeem with my stream elements points so you guys still earn points like i said but in the future i will make a video video that regards the redemption of the points in general i guess so but i have mine turned off i don't use it and then of course merch user just ordered and it'll say the item so if it's a t-shirt it'll say t-shirt that's pretty awesome as well so this one doesn't have an option to add neither does redemption but it looks like all of the other ones do so that's good so that's that you guys um very very simple to set up very easy to set up if you guys have any questions regarding this please let me know i will do my best to respond to you and help you out i actually love seeing this show up in my stream and actually because i use my own custom bot Mine doesn't say stream elements, it says Dakota bot, and then whatever the message might be. So if you are using a custom bot like what I showed in the last video of the stream elements videos, then it would look like that instead of just saying stream elements. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys in the next video.